What's going on everyone? This is Darian here with Diesel on Landscape and today in this video I'm going to be going over business card basics. What should you have on your business card? Okay, so the first thing that I want to say is a lot of people misuse business cards and they put their services on it and I guess in a way that's okay, but it's not it's not really a good business card if you have all your services on it, in my opinion. It may work for you, may, may not. But for me, uh, it's more professional if it doesn't have it. The less it has on the business card, the more clean and professional look it, it gives. If a big old, big time business owner gives you a business card, they're not going to have all their services listed on it. And this is kind of the same thing. Uh, you want something simple, clean, that, you know, it gets the point across of what you do. So these on the landscape, I have a QR code right here. I implement those on all the business cards that I make. And basically what that does is you take out your cell phone, scan it, and it goes straight to my Facebook page or it can go straight to my YouTube page, Google My Business, uh, anything like that. Whatever I want it to, I can put that QR code for that. So if I want more reviews on Google My Business, I could just put that QR code over this one. Real simple, real easy. On the back, I have my name, really big. I have my number, the locations. Uh, I have servicing around the city and probably about a 45 mile radius that I service. So, and then with that, I also have my email because the most two main points of contact that people are gonna have for you is gonna be your phone number and gonna be an email. Some people are old school, some people like to email you saying, hey, can you offer this, or can you service my yard, yada, yada, yada. Uh, I have my Facebook page name on there, and I have my YouTube page, and I'm probably gonna add my Instagram. I just made one of those. If you don't follow it, follow it now. Uh, I'll leave a link down in the description below for that. And then you wanna put your logo on the back of your card as well as the front, and that's for brand recognition. So basically, if you see me one time, you probably wouldn't remember me. If you see me twice, you probably like, where did have I seen that at? So it's kind of like that thing. Uh, the more that you have your logo on something, the more people are gonna start to realize that you're associated with that. So that's the business card basics. Uh, I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, please leave a comment down below and let me know what you put on your business cards. That being said, peace. One more thing before we get off here. I know my tool setup here is weak, so I need y'all's help. I need y'all to like, comment and subscribe to this channel right now i'll leave a little subscribe button right here so click this button it's probably gonna be like a little circle but click that and make sure that you're subscribed to my channel thank you all